Lurking in the bottom of the ocean are 10 venomous sea creatures. The species range from fish to animals and show some surprising characters. These include a venomous shark that's causing quite the stir at the Blue Reef Aquarium in South Sea. Amongst the toxic 10 are stingrays that can be found in the British seas. A reporter, Kirsty Chambers, dives in to find out more. In the depths of the ocean, you can find the toxic ten, a range of sea animals and fish that contain venom. The species range from stingrays, sea urchins and lionfish to a venomous shark. Uh, well, the toxic ten is a kind of a selection of some of the deadliest venomous and toxic animals that we've got here at the aquarium. Uh, it includes some animals such as sea anemones, sea urchins and jellyfish. Um, there's also some fish in there, some lionfish, uh, the fox-faced rabbit fish. But there's also some unexpected animals in there, such as some sharks we've got, which have got venomous spikes. Amongst the toxic ten, you can find a Californian horn shark and a Port Jackson shark. Both are unlike other species, as they contain venom. So most people think of sharks as being large, deadly, ferocious predators. Um, but these guys are actually quite small. There's the California horn shark and the Port Jackson shark and they've actually got great big spikes on their backs to protect themselves uh, so if anything comes along and tries to eat them they can defend themselves with the spike. The aquarium hoped to educate the general public on what animals are deemed the deadliest of the seas. Well, we think it's important that people know the variety of animals uh, in the undersea world um, but as well as that I think it's quite important that people know the variety of ways that these animals do defend themselves. Um, some of them have got uh, venom and poison to help them uh, attack their prey, but for the majority of them, it's to help them look after themselves against bigger fish. Part of the Toxic 10 features the adult and baby lionfish. They contain venom in their spines as a way of protecting themselves from their predators. We've got two different age groups of lionfish on site at the moment. We've got some beautiful babies and we've got some adults that are in our main shark tank. These guys have got venomous spines on their backs, which are uh, pretty deadly and they're used to protect themselves against anything that would try and eat them. One member of the Toxic Ten can be found in the British seas. So we've got common stingrays, so they're British ones. So they're ones you'd find in the Solent, so the sea right outside on our doorstep. Um, we've got a, a selection of them here. Most of them were bred here, actually. Um, and they've got a sting in their tail, and that's used to defend themselves. Um, so it's for protection. They don't use it to catch their prey, because um, in actual fact, they eat things like shellfish and, and crabs and things like that. Um, but that sting is there on the tail, and they can shed the sting and regrow it. Um, so if it gets damaged, they can just grow another one back. And it's, it's quite a dangerous toxin. Talks will be held at the Blue Reef Aquarium to show the lives of these deadly animals. Kirsty Chambers, for that Solent.